Henry the Green Engine has lived on the island of Sodor for many years. He wouldn't want to be anywhere else. He likes every part of it, from the fields filled with flowers to the bright sandy beaches. But there is one place that Henry always enjoyed visiting more than any other. He's driving you. We make good time today. We stop for a while by the forest. Henry loved it. The forest was full of drawn and tall pines. Henry could remember the day long ago when he and Toby brought some new trees to be planted and Terence and Trevor helped all them into place. Now, he could see the trees growing amongst the others on the hillside. Henry always felt better for being here. He couldn't really explain why, but his driver understood. It's peaceful, he said to Henry. Yes, indeed, replied Thomas, but what? We can't mend broken trees. <coughs> Toby got slowly in the yard. Hello, Toby, said the fat controller. You do look glum. I'm sad about the trees, said Toby, and so is Henry. The forest is a special place to him, now some of it is gone. We'll soon put that right. I have an important job for you, Toby. I would like you to take some trucks to the forest. When the trucks arrived, Toby was delighted. They were full of splendid young trees, all ready for planting. This is the best job I've When Henry returned, he was most surprised. There were Trevor and Terence busily helping the workmen clear the torn stumps and branches. Look, Henry, called Terence, we're beginning again. The hillside will look better than ever before. Now Henry can see the trees growing strong and tall, and the animals are coming back. Sometimes everywhere is quiet. At other times, Henry can hear leaves rustling or a bird's wing brushing the air. Often, he can hear the sound of children laughing, and always, he is happy here. 